Now, we're either being trolled or gaslighted, and I don't like it. <laughs> but before I get into this video, I'm trying to hit 1,600 subs before the end of the week. Need about 125 more people to do so. Definitely appreciate if you hit that subscribe button. Join the family. Now, USA Network is teasing us and trolling us. They're either teasing us or bullying us, and I don't like it. So um, if you don't know, there's been a bunch of coincidences, quote-unquote, of CM Punk references is there was the Seth Rollins calling himself the best in the world. There was uh Corey Graves saying the 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 greatest trick that ever the devil ever pulled was convince you that he didn't exist. Um there was the puppet quote, which I was kinda reaching. But then when you get to the point where Shinsuke Nakamura is hitting the GTS, it's just like, okay, you're kinda putting the hat on the hat. And you're kinda gaslighting me at this point. So, um, yeah, they're denying it. Um, there's been multiple reports that there's been coincidences. There's been reports saying that if there are any references, it wasn't on purpose or that there are some people who may be just trying to, you know, pull like, you know, mess with mess with CM Punk, kind of pull, kind of tug at Superman's cape, kind of trolling CM Punk. Hence my videos, my previous videos where I say that WWE, even though they're kind of clickbait, WWE is trolling CM Punk because it may be true. So, but now that uh, Shinsuke Nakamura, a clip of Shinsuke Nakamura hitting the GTS came out, and then you got USA Network, the people who just bought Fox, or who bought Fox quote-unquote property, I guess would be the word, SmackDown, the rights to SmackDown, I don't know when that goes into effect, who's been... Uh, the home of Monday Night Raw for however long, at least at least the last 10 years. They're teasing. They said, they commented under the clip of Shinsuke Nakamura hitting the GTS. It said, best in the world. Now, who do you know who hits the GTS and calls himself the best in the world? And now, and if, even if you think that's just somehow a coincidence, even if you think that USA Network is responding to comments, bro. <laughs> They're responding to comments, like, with little wink, wink, nudge, nudge. Like, bro, like, again, we're either being gaslighted, lied to, or, you know, troll. We're either getting made fun of, they're having fun at our expense, and I don't like it. I don't like it at all. Um, it's nasty. <laughs> unless, unless CM Punk is appearing on my screen in a month and six days time i am having a problem with this i don't like it and i need answers <laughs> i like if if this leads to cm punk returning then of course of course by all means keep teasing us but if cm punk is not in survivor series chicago are y'all going to keep telling us that y'all are not referencing him on purpose we go have a problem and i'm gonna have to come to stanford connecticut and somebody go have to see me Somebody go out to see me, man, because this is just nasty at this point. And um, I, I, I don't know, man. I'm not about the trip. I remember, you know, like the networks won't see him punk. The uh, the the uh, higher up, whoever gave, uh, I believe it was WBD or whatever, whoever gave Tony Khan, whoever told Connie, Tony Khan they wanted Collision, they gave. CM Punk that nickname one Bill Phil because he's the one true article he's the one true article in a, uh, a world full of counterfeit bucks you, you remember the line like that guy specifically wanted CM Punk um, back when WWE backstage happened uh, when Fox first got required the rights for Smackdown the higher ups wanted CM Punk in 2019 but Vince McMahon said no which kind of worries me but Vince McMahon isn't there anymore. He has no creative control anymore. Maybe he has influence on in who gets hired. But other than that, he's not that guy anymore. So I don't know if you got that say, Kimo Sabe. Like, I don't know what bad blood is so bad that you can't, that you don't want CM Punk back. But I don't know. I don't know. I'm pretty sure Triple H can bring back Bray Wyatt, Hit Row. Who else did he bring back? Uh... Dakota Kai, did he bring back Dakota Kai and Eoska? 
I know he brought back one of them. Um, uh, my apologies, but if he could bring back who he brought back, I'm pretty sure he could bring back one Bill Phil. But um, I apologize for my monotone tone at this point. It's 3.30 in the morning as I'm recording this, and I'm very tired. But I appreciate it if y'all hit that subscribe button. Most of my videos aren't this low. Uh, this is very tame me. I'm usually very hype, kind of, not really. But I definitely appreciate it if you hit that subscribe button. We're trying to hit 1,600 subs before the end of the week. Definitely appreciate it if you hit that subscribe button. Do something to make yourself smile today. Be beautiful people. Make someone smile today. Peace.